many rural parts of the world, people who are sick lack easy access to health care. Too often, their only options are to make a multi-day walk to a hospital or wait it out and hope for the best. The lack of health care makes small problems larger and large problems like the coronavirus pandemic a disaster. Four out of five citizens live in rural areas. This means over 22 million people in Nepal struggle to get the health care they need. Rural areas have a lack of health care workers and facilities, whereas urban areas are abounding with talent and health care workers. The solution is video conferencing. Telemedicine is the use of the internet for video conferencing, for a physician to give a consultation or opinion on any patient anywhere. There are over 30,000 Rotary Clubs in the world, and they are our conduit to give a proper distribution of world care via the internet. Global telemedicine enables the physician to video conference with the patient, examine the patient, and using equipment such as electronic stethoscope or ultrasound to make a diagnosis. The diagnosis leads to proper treatment. Global telemedicine has improved countless patient outcomes over the past nine years. Currently, we're partnered with 18 hospitals in Africa, Asia, and the Caribbean. Dr. Prakash says when the pandemic came in 2020, it became clear that it also helps to reduce the risk to doctors and nurses. Doctors from different areas can also share what they're learning about COVID-19. World health is being improved by telemedicine. It enables us to reach out anywhere and provide diagnostic consultation and education. Dr. Prakash says Using the same technology, we're seeking to start a pilot project connecting hospitals across Nepal, so ICU patients from different places can be monitored from a central location. Global telemedicine is the means of improving world health care now and in the future. I am enthusiastic this goal can be obtained. <laughs>